are inmates who come in with the lowest level of, of crimes. And I'm sorry, I know there's a lot of discretion that happens out there with policing, even at the juvenile level, because all 98% of the people, that the kids that we represent in our system right now, and that's Philadelphia, are black and brown, 98%. I know, I've gone to school and have some very good friends that are not black, and I know the things that they do. And I know that many of them, if they were given the same treatment that our young black kids were given, would be in the system. But I wanted to answer your question directly, because that discretion is huge. And so when you have droves of people coming into this system that are not violent, that are not dangerous, what is the purpose of that? And I believe is to protect the business of this industry. And if you want to know who's benefiting from the industry, you can Google organizations or corporations that contract for prison labor, where they are able to get it at a, a, a fraction of the cost. But then let's take it outside. In Pennsylvania, we have 935 legislative actions that ex exclude people from certain qualities of life if you have a crime, a criminal conviction. Now, if that's the case, where are those people going to work? The low-level jobs, the Walmarts. But wherever they can to make the big 